you probably heard from the media, the recording says it's either from them or from Taiwan. And then you can hear him chuckling. For one thing, my candidate would not laugh about a situation like this. This topic is important to him, and he would never make a joke out of it. He stopped by and shook hands with a few supporters and then left in time to get to a very important meeting. The meeting started at 12.30, and he arrived there early at 12. The fundraiser started around 11.30, leaving my candidate less than 30 minutes to even be at the fundraiser, let alone time to answer questions. My theory is that the recording was a mesh of words out of context from his speech a few weeks back. As he did discuss this topic in his speech, it would be fairly easy for someone to take his words out of context and make this recording. The recording was not even a video, it was just an audio file. I have the original audio file before it was touched up to sound legit to show to you today. But first, let's start with the pictures and video evidence that my candidate was in the meeting. You can see here the photos along the sides are pictures of him in the meeting and here's a video of the meeting. So my pretty much what I want to do here, I want to find the, the right way to get women every single right that they deserve. I spoke uh, recently at a, at a conference talking about how I want women to get everything right and uh, their right to avoid their child and their right to actually uh, be who she wants to be and the freedom and the liberty. So. so my, pretty much from, so my. As you can see on the clock, you can see what time he was in the meeting. And that's about 11.55 near the end of the meeting. And here's the recording. Are you in favor of supporting the imports of goods from China? It's either from them or from Taiwan. As you can tell, it sounds... This was the original one before it was touched up to sound smooth. So, yeah. RJ? What time did you say the meeting started? It started at... Uh, <laughs> at 12.30. <laughs> and why was it 11.59? You got there at 12, though. Oh. Oh. And the, and that was at the end of the meeting, so that proves that the media... Oh, oh you're <laughs> that the media's lying, but it shows that you're lying right now. So if he showed up the way earlier, then you would even say it. He completed the meeting before he had showed up. That's what you're saying. Well, he's talking about abortion either. So I don't understand the point of that video at all. <laughs> okay, the audience clip put on church line happened at the fundraiser. So what does the meeting footage have to do with anything? The audio footage was to prove to you guys that it sounded like... But did it, the audio came from a fundraiser, right? Yes. So why was there no footage of the fundraiser? Because that meeting didn't prove anything. It was just an audio them. recording. They had a tape recorder. Of two different places. <laughs> it was and not two different topic. places. Oh. No, the video with the meeting was to show you that he was in a meeting. Before he got there? Before you told us he got there? <laughs> he literally got there and finished the meeting before it <laughs> Okay. I was just yeah. there. Okay, so, hold on. Go ahead. Okay, so, if, I don't know where Why did you lie? I meant to say that it started at 11.30, and the speech, it was typo. Okay, yeah, okay, I don't remember. Okay, so, if you have the fake audio, then what happens to the real audio? So how do we know that is the fake audio? That's not the fake audio. That's the real audio before so it was sent like to this? the media to be smoothed out. So he talks like choppy like that? Yes, because they took it from his speech. They took words from his speech to make it sound like he said it with his voice. What speech was this? Because they were talking about abortion. 
meeting. That was the last one. But before that, they're talking about the outsourcing and the U.S. steel mills, and he talked about how we had jobs in China. So they took words from that. Then why did he say Taiwan? He also mentioned Taiwan. Chris. Well, since he knew he had a meeting at 12.30 and he had a fundraiser, which should both be important, wouldn't he put himself with more like time schedule to get there and not have to blow up one thing instead of the other? That's why he showed up at the fundraiser. So close together as president, are we going to have to worry about him being one place and somewhere completely different before he can get out there? That's why he showed up at the fundraiser, shook hands with a few supporters, and didn't have time to answer questions because he had enough meeting to... But he got there early, so he had plenty of time. He got to the meeting early, he didn't so, get to the fundraiser early. But he actually got to the meeting way earlier than supposed to be, like an hour earlier, and finished it before he was supposed to be there. He had plenty of time, I assume. <laughs> as I look at the evidence that you have, I see your argument as invalid. So, can you speech try had to typo. It started at 11. How the meeting started at 12.30, but he was ending the meeting at 11.59. It wasn't over. The meeting started at 11.30, right? This video shows that he was in there at 11.55, and...